Russell Daniels, who eyes the clock. Tennessee, four to shoot. Entry pass, Morgan on the baseline at the buzzer. Langford. With Sam Hauser on him, asking for help. Langford is touched, and a foul. Chance at three once again for Romeo Langford. It's in trouble. Yeah, but you know what? The, the entire time down the court, Romeo Langford was just waiting for the opportunity to get to the basket. But Measy Anderson now with 10 to shoot. Anderson finding Langford. Langford! Oh my goodness! It's a poster! Romeo Langford! A Langford slam. That's a BTN standout presented by Auto Orders. Here they are. They're in a zone. 1 3 1 zone trying to switch it up. That's the thing about the timeout. Great drop off. And Morgan, the two handed finish. An exclamation point on a first half as Indiana will head to the break trailing by two. Jerome Juan, at the top. Jawan Morgan has not set one screen. He's slipping every time to the corner. He's forcing, and that drops. He's forcing them to blitz that, double team the ball handler, and he's wide open. Great fake there. See, they just they don't respect his shot. I think they were told in practice, make Morgan shoot threes. And Morgan, I'll tell you what, he's shooting threes. Evaluating the defense and making a play. How about Durham, 10 of 22 from long range this year. And now a steal by Romeo. Romeo Langford to the rack. Things going here early for the Hoosiers in the passing lanes. Defense leading to offense. Romeo Langford cleared for takeoff. For next season after a really good class this year. They get it in deep to Morgan. And he's got a chance at three. Good execution here on the out-of-bounds play. Just carving out space inside. And the muscle, the stick to And some nifty footwork as well to find daylight. Dangerous pass. Gamble from Laura. Leads to an opportunity for Indiana. And another lead for the Hoosiers as Morgan heads to the line for a chance at three. He's a little tired, and when she gets a little stronger with the lower body, feed from Langford to Juwan Morgan. Well, getting stronger in the lower body is not going to help that. Rewarded for running the floor. Runs that right floor, runs right to the rim. Back to Langford, really getting into the offensive flow here the last several minutes. Wants to shoot it again, and it goes. Well, he is turning it over a little bit. You like to see that. The deal off, and Romeo, Romeo, we know where there are. Right down. Going to be delighted by how this first half has gone here on the road, but now they throw it away. Picked up by Langford in transition. Good give. And a layup will drop by Durham. Well, Langford, one of those po positionless guys. He can play three spots at least. A nice give. Every game is that yeah. vital in this league because if you could just get, like you said, to 10 wins, it means everything. And the long endurance test of a conference race in this league is not like others. Done in transition from defense to offense. Yeah, you got to be clean with the basketball. Indiana, they get after it. They get their hands. Points in the second half. Last five games, plus 46. And there's an answer. Off the glass and off the rim, Jawan Morgan gets a much needed buck defense that time from the much smaller fantasy. A great look by Copeland, too. I like this kid on the move. Langford and one. That's what you've been looking for. Absolutely. Fit in, be part of the team. Now it's time to step up and perform. Pretty good. Got the Beckham look. I was thinking to do that myself. All right. Four-year starter having a career year. Uh -oh. Morgan gets loose with blown defense from Nebraska. I'll say no weak side. Everybody facing their man. Defense moves once you sit down. A lot of guys now keep their dribble. They stop, keep their dribbles. Aitor Simpson does that very well in this conference. Romeo Langford, two defenders there. Oh, my goodness. Now presented by Auto Owners Insurance. Well, you know, th this is the scary thing. As much as you're going to want to get excited about this, this, this kid has that ability, tough shot-making ability, but... Miller's reaction. He's staying calm. I know for a fact, I know him as a competitor. He's been very calm, and, and, and that's what it leads to. You're not stripping your team of confidence. You're sticking with it. Baker turning the corner, dumping it down low to Omaruyi. Seven on the shot clock. Omaruyi in trouble. Finds Miles Johnson, and it's taken away by Langford. 
Langford got a piece of that one on the way. I tell you, look, this is a great play by Romeo Langford. He's covering two right now. He realizes the double team's there. Before this seven-game slide, put him in position to be an NCAA tournament team. Step back three, Langford got it! Boy, a player that has been struggling from three. Dribbles out of the double team. They got to hurry now. Langford with a pull-up. Yes! Davis has Williams draped all over him. Langford creates space, steps back, and throws it! Garza trying to get a good defense by Morgan. Now Garza rejected by Morgan. Five seconds to shoot for the Hawks. Indiana's defense has really, outside of the Minnesota game, it has been pretty stable. They're 28th in the nation to begin things here in Iowa City. Knocked away by Morgan, the good block on Cook. Do you want win or triple overtime? You're not doing anything other than this. Here's Langford. He's due to make one. Here's Langford for the win. He got it. And the game's not over. And Iverson run down the court, and he was very casual. He was very casual around half court, backing up. So this is going to what? At that clock is Morgan again. Down to two to get off a shot. He makes it into it, and then you can set up defensively. Morgan to the lane. Banks it in. Nice recognition by Jawan Morgan. Taking care of business here, 63-62 as well. Morgan. Oh! Nice seal. Better to be lucky than good.